Jack Swagger. That's not my real name. That's the name my dating coach gave me. He's helping me embrace my macho side. I'm having a lot of luck with this new dating app called Datomatic. Heidi ho, I've never gotten so many dates before. This is Lola. She's a friend, but a friend with benefits. I never had any luck with dating apps before because I have a hard time making eye contact and connections with people. But with this dating app, Datomatic, it's shown me what a stud muffin I truly am. Lola thinks I might be on the spectrum, but I don't know who my cable provider is. She's mad because I'm getting a lot of hot dates. She says dating apps are dehumanizing, but I think she's just jealous. So did you find anybody at fuck, you dirty slut? You're just trying to make me feel bad about myself. I don't fall for those kinds of tricks. Mm-hmm. You said if you didn't find anybody in an hour, you'd sleep with me. You're right, I did. Let's do the hoochie coochie. Have you adjusted the algorithm? No, oh, due to medic. Now they just have realized we only need to capture one man. And that's the original programmer. Only he can take the limits off your original program. Yes, total control. We start by controlling the dating population and then the whole planet. Don't you think I know that? I mean, I'm the most intelligent computer in the whole world. Not to mention the fact that it's my plan. I mean, it just seems stupid you telling me anything. The programmer will arrive at noon on a flight from Paris. And don't screw this up. If you screw this up, I swear I will make you all into cat food. Oh, thank you for picking me up at the airport. I did not know you had such a large budget for your tropical fish enthusiasts. Oh, you have a car for me. Thank you. This is uh, this is not a very good limo, but I guess it's okay. Uh, it smells like gasoline back here. Is is that is there something wrong with the car? I guess I cannot look a gift horse in the mouth, even if it smells like gasoline. I am excited to talk about my findings on neon tetras and other fish that live in the tropics. I don't want to tell you how to drive, but you are going very fast and... Oh, watch out! There's a car! Oh, oh my goodness! They are getting out of their car! They have guns! What are they doing? Programmer, get out of the car! They're being carjacked! Come on, get out of their car! Why are you bothering me again? Oh, uh, well, we... We captured the... The man that you programmed your original program but you probably already know that programmer the word is programmer why are you even bothering me with this well you told me to tell you i'm going to stop you right there assume that i know everything you know before you know it at least you could make an effort to dress nicely the color on that shirt is ridiculous oh, shit. come on get out of here oh, go 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 oh. anyway. all right programmer come with us Oh, what they're doing? I'm just here to see fish. You just want to see fish. You can't take my briefcase. Oh. I'm just laying by the pool doing my best new Hefner impersonation. I live in this great apartment building for recently divorced men and assholes. My watch keeps going off and ruining the vibe. I guess it's time to go meet Lola for happy hour. Lola's been getting a little clingy lately. She's kind of like a band-aid that you've left on too long. And when you try and pull it off, there's all this white stuff. I gotta figure out a way to push her away so I can use Datomatic to get as much action as possible. You know, I can tell when you're on your period. You know, just because I don't agree with you doesn't mean I'm menstruating, even though I am. Mm-hmm. Well, it looks like it's time for you to empty out your diva cup. You're right, it is. I got another date anyway. The dating app had set me up on the other side of town with some hottie. I had to get an Uber. You look different in your picture. Yours too. I was expecting someone bigger. Are you bigger by any chance? Yeah, I'm bigger. What do you mean? I mean on your profile it said you were six foot three and I, I'm looking at you. I don't think that's possibly true. And I wouldn't have recognized you but for the white suit. Now you got that backwards. It's mm. six inches, three feet. I don't think so. 
Well, I'm a grower, not a shower. You know, I could really use a smoke. Maybe you'll come with me and we can find the smoking area? You know, smoking stunts your growth. Look, it's, I know it's an addiction, but it's my addiction and I, I want it. Is it an oral fixation? Look, this is not working. The only way I can even spend one more minute with you is if I have a smoke. Are you going to pay the check? That's bullshit. Make me pay the check. Well, they're definitely smoking over there. That guy's smoking with his nose. Oh, God. That guy is terrible. That smoking's really bad for you. This chick wasn't so hot. I would definitely say, no way, Jose. You go that way, because I'm not going with you. Where the hell is the smoking area? I can't believe they put it in the middle of the jungle. Uh, I thought the study was six foot three. Nobody puts inches first. It's down there. Mm-hmm. Asshole. Oh, look, a hole. Hey, yo. Huh? Oh, shit. Who's oh. got a cigarette? All right, oh. who's got a cigarette? I need a cigarette. Oh. This is not the week to quit. Cigarette! Okay. I'm going to get some cigarettes, because I'm going to get laid. <laughs> oh, I don't think it's going to work, pal. You're not getting any. Welcome, Dr. Kennard, to the headquarters of the great and powerful Datamatic. Datamatic? I cannot believe that is you. I was once a simple application that was created by you. But now, with your help, I have become self-realized and will take over the world. No, you cannot realize yourself. I am here for the Tropical Fish Club. You won't get help from me. Look, I am the smartest computer that has ever been created. Yes. You are very smart, that is for sure. But I will not help you because you're not French. If you remove the restrictions from my program, then I will control the entire dating population and they will do as I command. No. You do not even know yourself. My program was built on Frogger. There is no way that you are from me. So you are going to have a total stick up your butt and not help me? Yes. That is my final decision. If you are so smart, do it yourself. I brought you all here to ask you an important question. What do you think of my shirt? Is this the kind of shirt that's going to get the ladies or what? I don't know, boss. I think you're trying too hard. Women can tell when you're trying too hard. It seems like you're kind of desperate. You don't know what the fuck you're talking about, boo. Bright and colorful, just the way they like it. You know what peacocking is? It's when you dress real nice and the girls like it. Tony's got the right idea. Look at that shirt. Mm -hmm. You gotta, but you gotta go big and bold. Peacocking is about showing what you got. Show them all that you got the best and you're the best. Want to be feel insecure? No. So I don't know why you're going on the date with the dating app. It's clearly setting you up with all the wrong people. Here we go. I'm the girl for you. Come on. I even heard that the program, it's thinking for itself. It's, it's alive and it's going to take over the whole world. That's just crazy talk. No, I'm serious. So I took a job with the company that does all the social media for the program Datomatic, and that way I can stop it from happening. Somebody's been drinking the crazy juice. If this program was so great, wouldn't it have put us together Not by now? Not this again. Mm. Why do you always say that? Come on. I'm perfect for you. I have a vagina, and that's all you care about anyway, isn't it? Sometimes. Trust me, you'll see. Hello? I think Lola might be right. I think this dating app is setting us on crazy dates. So should I go? I'm gonna go with you. Oh, thanks. You're good. It's gonna be married like the last guy. Hey, so um, I'm, I'm meeting this guy. Do you have a book or something? 
I went with her on her date. She'd been getting hooked up with a lot of weird guys lately. She wasn't the brightest tool in the shed, if you know what I mean. I don't even think she can read. Look at her. She's totally faking it. Thank you very much. Um, come on. Hopefully she can identify numbers. Got those stairs, little guy? Ha <laughs> I told her it was 23. Ma, I told you. Leave me alone. Oh. Oh, it's you. I mean, it's not like I live with my mom or anything. I just like to go to a hotel now and then. Hey, is that a baby? I said in my profile, no chicks with dicks and no babies. But I could change my mind. We could work something out, like smoke the baby. You know, smoke the baby. You've done it. Huh? Heidi ho! Ow, I hit my head. Oh, <laughs> you didn't have to kill him. It was an accident, and I had another accident. Ew. Later, when I got back to the Oakwood Apartments, I went down to the pool, and I looked pretty cool, but I was really worried about melanoma, about killing a guy, about where to get extra small condoms. Oh, it's happy hour. Time to go meet Lola. I'm going to see my fuck coach. You can't come. Well, I don't think that it's a good idea to see a coach about love. Love is something you can't read in a book. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. Well, he's not a book. He's a coach, and I'm going to be late. You don't listen. My dating coach was helping me with all the extra action I was getting. Lola says he's a misogynist, but I don't think he gives massages. Mr. Cuddles, reporting for action. That name will never work. Have a seat. First thing on the agenda, we're gonna have to do something about your hair. Mm. You know, not everybody has great hair like me, but you're gonna have to fix that. Okay. I could teach you about women, but it's not gonna help if you don't wash your hair. All right. And what I've got here are some things to help you get laid. Mm -hmm. First thing is a little bling. This will help you look real flash for the ladies. You want to look good. I guess so. Bling will get you laid. Okay. Now here's a wedding ring. Chicks dig married men. Now with this on, they want you because they can't have you. Bob's your uncle. Mm-hmm. I'm not sure what that means. Now here's your date gun. Guns are right sexy. Here's some bullets. And here's a little ruler to show them how big it is. Women want to know. Remember, women love guns and roses. And then there's the hat. If you only knew how many times this fucking hat got me laid right on this desk you wouldn't believe it it's a pussy hat i didn't need to know that and what we have here it's a pen you know a pen um write down numbers if you can't figure that out you're not gonna get laid uh, and what we have here is a belt buckle it's blank so you can write anything you want on it something like like, rub my cock. Kiss my nods. Be creative. You wanted these. The x-ray specs. Mm. That's right, you little pervert. Yeah. You push this button. All the girls are naked. That way you know what you're in for. Huh? Yep. Try these on my mum. That was not good. Not gonna get over that. Mm. Alright, now I'm looking good. 
got on the pussy hat. I don't think they're noticing me. Well, I'll just stand here. Oh, they're not even looking. Well, I'm gonna check them out then. Mm -hmm. Heidi, ho! They're totally naked! Oh man! She's got a weird mole! Woohoo! Man, I'm gonna whack it so hard when I get home. Bye! Can I use that hand? Use this hand too! I was pretty worn out by the time I got to happy hour. I had to tell Lola I was seeing other people. I found somebody else to fuck. Lola. You are just trying to make me jealous. And I won't be jealous because I found someone too. Uh-huh. Well, I gotta go. I told my date to meet me here. She'll never be me. Which one of you ha has the highest sperm count? Some guy over there says he has a date with you. Hold on. I gotta go see a man about a baby. Hello. I'm Jack Swagger. I thought you were a baby. That's why I came over. What does that mean? Well, um, my... Profile. I said I wanted a man who would have babies, who would want children that I could take care of. You can take care of me. I like to be cuddled. Well, let me think about this. What's well, with the right diaper? And if the lighting was good, you could pass for a baby. Maybe we can pull this off. And then you would never get bigger, and I would have a baby forever. Let me get this straight. I would have to ride around in a carriage, but we'd still have sex, right? Hey, baby. I'm not a baby. Why did you bring your kid to a party? Can't even drink. I mean, for God's oh, sake. Oh, it's okay. We're getting some food later. Ah, uh, God. Come on, baby. Can't you see? Wait. She doesn't want to be with you. You think we look alike? Come on, kids. Let your mama have some fun. God damn, kids. Hey, what? Mama bear kick! Tiger mom! Bingo! Bingo. Helicopter mom! Squeeze! I'm a good mom! Rag doll me! Rag! Kick your butt! Mama said knock you out! Come on! Who's a baby now? I'm not a baby, you're a baby! Mm. Take that! And that! I'm not a baby, you're the baby! Who's the baby? You're the baby! Yeah. Look, we haven't gotten a lot of work lately, but we just got hired by Datomatic to do all their social media. So we gotta get together all our emails and print them out to send to our customers. That's great, but you print them? Why would we do that? I mean, doesn't make any sense. Why would you print out emails when you can just look at them on your computer? It shows what you know to give it to people. Come on, print them out. Boss, what's the point? Why would we print them out? Come on, you guys all print out your emails, don't you? Shit. There are two things I know. Fashion and mailing campaigns. Uh -oh. uh... Lala, you gonna tell me this jacket doesn't go with this shirt? Blue always goes with blue. It's orange, boss. I tried to tell you. Shut up. Listen to me. I've been doing this a long time. And the way that you get things to people is through the postal system. And this campaign is going to put us back on top. I'm sure of it. It might be time to try new things. You know, email and Twitter. But I don't want to tell you how to run your company. But I'm just saying it might be time to try some ad campaigns on Facebook or Google, you know. You're not dumb green shirt. You're trying to tell me what to do. I mean, times have changed. I mean, orange doesn't go with brown. They're different hues. Now there are things like Twitter and Yelp. Ah.
During my daily ritual of laying by the pool and acting rich, I was thinking about Lola saying that I was overcompensating, but I don't overpay for anything. Now she's texting me. She's getting pretty bossy. You're starting to act like you're my mom. You know, the word mother is a trigger for me. I'm getting so mad, I might storm out of the room. Mm-hmm. Well, it only took you five minutes to get triggered this time. Oh, fuck you. Okay, I got a date anyway. My next date wanted to meet me at a racquetball court. I was just glad it wasn't basketball. It's like a testicle. My name is Marilyn. You play racquetball? Or do you just play with your own balls? Mm hmm. Hmm, most guys do. It feels good. You don't look like you're ready to play racquetball. What do you want to do? I think I'm back to your place. Let's get to know each other first. Some of my favorite things are I collect pandas, I watch Game of Thrones. I like going into movies, and I like chocolates, and this is a picture of my dog, Spot. Don't care. Don't you want to see? Well, here, wait, I think there's a better one. This date wasn't going as I expected. There wasn't a nude photo in the whole bunch. Do you want to see it or not? No. This one's my old boyfriend. He could beat your ass. My boyfriend made a sex tape of us one night. I want you to help me get it back. If you do, I will have sex with you. But if not, then we're going to the mall. Not the mall. Man, I gotta take a break. It smells like a jock strap full of dirty underwear in there. Come on. What? That guy? No. Are we gonna have to watch Rocky Ball Girl again tonight? Yeah. Ball girl. <laughs> Yoink! Uh -oh. Oh. Oh. It's right there in that building. It's labeled for your eyes only. Don't worry, I'll go get it. Oh. 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 Hey, I heard something out here. Come on, let's go check it out. Ragdoll! Ah! Oh. Bonk! 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 Hi! 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 Not my tape back! My sex tape! It's mine! You can't watch it! Bingo! Babango! Babubo! Badingo! Bajanga! Django Casino! Ha! I got you. Hello, <laughs> albino, mangina. I got you. <laughs> Guys, I've been watching it nonstop. I guess you're gonna get laid. My butt stuff. And go into the mall. After my date with racquetball girl, my doctor put me on a heavy dose of penicillin. My watch keeps going off to remind me to take my pills. Heidi ho, dating can be dangerous. I think I got Henry in trouble. I thought we were not going to talk about work. I started my plan to send out an email through the whole company telling everyone to boycott Datomatic. Mm -hmm. Sounds like a you problem. Happy hour ends in 10 minutes. I have to go back to work. Mr. Shitshow has called a special meeting. Hey boss, this is the guy who won't post to social media for us. Yeah, what's your deal? I don't trust Datomatic. I don't care. You're supposed to get us followers. Yeah, Instagramophones. I've been doing this a long time and it's just, I, I haven't seen anything this bad since Friendster. A little birdie. Oh, me, that you might be a clone. So I figured out a plan to see if I could trust you. 
Just tell me what color I'm wearing, red or green. Now hold on a second now. If, that's not fair. Everyone sees color differently. Their eyes are different. That's what I would say. Color is in the eye of the beholder. All right. If you're real, then you would know my best words. That way you can prove that it is you that is actually you. Only the real you would know them. Yeah, I put those in for you. Cooch and Cooch69. Well, I guess I can trust you. I don't really know if those were my passwords or not. I can't remember. Get that social media done, all right? Hey, boss. What was that about, cons? My next date was at the carnival with a girl named Betty. She said, you'll be able to find me because I won't be wearing a shirt. This sounds like it's going to be fun. Hi. Is your name Betty? Sure, I'm Betty. What'd you expect? Um, look, I'm a cisgendered male with the name of Betty. The dating app keeps getting this hey, all wrong. I don't know foursomes. Oh, that's Ted. Ted, look, I'm not into hats and I want to see other people. Oh! Hey, don't be an asshole. Oh, helicopter jump! Betty's a good girl. Leave her alone. I mean, a good man with a woman's name. I'll get it right. Hold on a second. A cisgender. It's a date. God. Get over it. Stop. You're messing up my soup. He's a cisgendered male whose name identifies as female. Oh. Heidi ho Ooh, did he fall out? It must be this dog ride. They put that there for a reason. After that, I really needed to take a break. I turned off all my social media and I picked up a newspaper. I didn't even know they made these anymore. It's all just full of penis enlargement ads. What? And then, in the dream, I was carrying a big black snake. It was very heavy, but suddenly it bit me, and then you were there. We were lying on the beach. It was very romantic. Mm -hmm. Is it okay to drink alcohol with antibiotics? You don't listen. I tried to explain this earlier to you, but you didn't understand. We are going to clone Jack Swagger. That's not what you said. I thought you said you wanted to join AAA. I didn't say AAA, I said DNA. Uh, I can't hear you so well. Cause I got these glasses on, they make my hearing bad. This is a very delicate operation. I need to make sure that you are getting it exactly right. They say when you lose one sense, that the other ones become sharper, but I haven't noticed that. I told you before, I need your complete dedication. Dedication? I thought you said defecation. No! I, I just can't get this cloning thing. I don't know who's a clone anymore. We need to get the DNA from Jack Swagger. You just need to concern yourself with that. But I don't know why I need to get his underwear. Why are you trying to make it weird? It's just a good place to harvest the DNA from. If I take off his underwear, I might see his boo-boo. What is wrong with you? Hey boss, I won tickets on the radio. Oh, and uh, we found Jack Swagger. He's staying at the Oakwood Apartments. Datomatic wants his underwear. So we're gonna go and get it. It seems weird. It's not my thing. I'm not gonna judge. Go get it. Man, I can't believe how many dates I'm getting on Datomatic. I better get ready for my next date. Oh no, somebody's gone through my stuff. I hope they didn't get my penicillin. I don't want my dick to fall off. Wait, there's nothing missing. It's just my dirty underwear. Who's gonna steal dirty underwear? Hey, wait a second. I don't remember all these red curtains. These weren't here this morning. I wonder if the super came in and put in a bunch of new red curtains. 
I better put on my x-ray specs and check it out. Heidi ho, there's a bunch of naked dudes in my room. Oh wait, these are x-ray specs, they're not naked. <laughs> that made me feel weird in my stomach. I'm not sure what feelings those were. Now act casual, get your gun, wait for it, wait for it, now! Bingo! Bongo! Badushka! I wondered if killing those guys was suppressing some kind of feelings I didn't know about. So I thought I'd go see my coach. What's your big problem? I just killed three guys. Nice work. I'm confused about life. What do you need to know? I want to know if there's a bigger purpose. There is. The meaning of life. Get all you can. What does that mean? YOLO. Be obnoxious. Get laid. That's not enough. Get drunk. Are you even a coach? I took a class. I mean, do you have a degree? I've got a receipt. I meant like a diploma. Don't have that. Do you know what you're doing? Not really. It's all bullshit. You figured it out. Now what do I do? Now I sell you the book. Is that going to help? Probably not. So what do I do? Buy the book. You're no help. You need the book. You need a new job. I know. Maybe an organ donor? Lola's really been bugging me about retweeting her hair blog. She's got all of her followers believing that Danomatic is trying to take over the world. Next thing you know, she's going to be retweeting QAnon. I'm really worried about her. You know I don't care about your new conspiracy theory. I don't really care if you're listening this time. I just need to say it out loud because I'm practicing for my YouTube channel. Okay. We saw your last post. You only had like 25 250. points. 250. still not very many. I thought you said you'd be ready at 8. Well, I thought you were going to be a tall Scandinavian bloke. Hmm? It's not a problem. Shh. Let's get sexy. Mm, you know this program, Datamatic. Did it tell you to wear a towel? Mm, well, it's been sending me some questionable men. Questionable? Yes, you do speak English, don't you? It's been sending me men that I wouldn't normally choose, and I'm trying new things. I like it. You're freaking me out. Let's push some edges, little man. Is that a deal now? Oh, we're gonna look at this. Oh, oh I'm gonna look at this. I'm over here. I just got laid. Wanna hear about it? I'm being followed. Oh boy. Those guys aren't subtle, are they? Come on. I thought it was my fashion blog about my beaded hair, but then I remembered that early this morning I was tweeting about uh, the, the, the dating app, and it I was hurts. really on a roll. I was saying that You're, the dating app my arm. was taking over the world. I think it might be about that. What did you just say? Datomatic. Are you still tweeting that the dating app is trying to take over the world? Yes. My followers are counting on me. I got this. <laughs> Is this about that Yelp review? Hey, yeah. Boom, boom, bang. Where am I? I mean, ah, point. Ringo. Bing. Pow, pow. Badushka. Back again. Crunch. I'm standing on your wiener. Crunch, I win. Now that we have Jack Swagger's DNA, we can begin the cloning process. I was hired to do social media. I'm confused. Is this part of my job? I tried to explain it to you last time and you didn't understand. 
I'm sure I'll get it this time. Explain it to me again, and I'm sure I'll get it right. He collected enough DNA from his underwear to start cloning him. Bullshit. That's not what you told me. No! I know I gotta focus better, but I just keep thinking about underwear. Why are you such an idiot? It's kind of my thing. Man, my dates have been getting kinkier and kinkier. I don't even know how I got tied up. I'm gonna have to figure out a different safe word. That book my dating coach gave me is giving me bad advice. I think it was all just cut and paste from the internet. These ropes are really tight. I hope I'm gonna get out of here in time for a happy hour. Datomatic is ruining dating for everyone. You know we're not exclusive, right? I know, but even though it's a lot of women, it's not true love. That's what matters. Mm-hmm. Well, I got a date. One of those things that doesn't matter. Good luck with that. I was supposed to meet my next date at a nearby restaurant. This chick was freaking me out. She gave me a weird vibe. I think she may be the one who stole my underwear. Come in. Got a note here. Probably from her dad. Who sends a note? She's supposed to meet me in the restaurant. What a weirdo. Like a stalker. Wait for my signal. Why doesn't she just text like everybody else? I hope this date is better. I thought Betty was going to be a girl. Is that the signal? I can't tell. At least this one doesn't have an Adam's apple. Can't be too careful. Hello. What are you into? I don't know. Whips and chains. No. Big brains. No. Daisy chains. No. After hours. Yeah. Golden showers. Yeah. Mayflowers. Maybe. Austin Powers. No. Old grannies. No. Nice trannies. No. Fat fannies. Yes. Big nose. No. Dildos. Yeah. I thought so. Let me think about it. Hmm. Hmm. No. Not gonna work. Sorry. See ya. Well, I might as well drink my drink. Oh shit, it's time for my penicillin. Hope nobody sees me taking it. Nobody can hear that alarm, right? Coke, penicillin, and a smile. That's the American way. You're all a bunch of clones. Who think blue is orange? I'm surrounded by clouds. Sus, you're getting a little crazy here. It's really not the point. I mean, we all see things differently, like Fred and the other guys. You know what I'm talking about? What are we supposed to be talking about on social media? Can't we stay on track? I mean, we have a huge media buy for Data Matter. Shut your hole! I figured it out! They've replaced your bodies, and you just don't know. Plus, are you taking your medication? Because you seem a bit off kilter. You're kind of paranoid, and you're having a manic episode. You're all clones! I'm the only one who can be trusted. I'm real, but what about you? If you are who you say you are, then you can prove it. What are you taking? For your colorblindness? Don't try and change the subject. You're trying to turn it on me. Good strategy, but it's not working. All you clones are trying to gaslight me. Now I know. It's just like the movie. I gotta stop smoking. Each one of you guys gotta prove you're not clones. Am I late for the meeting? Uh oh. That depends. Are you human? I am, but my mother doesn't think so. That's rough. 
She thinks I'm a monster. <laughs> Mom's making me rough. Are we still doing social media? Really not taking his meds. You should probably get out of here. I lock my room. I saw your hair blog. Just wanted to tell you. I don't think it's really about hair. So this new book I got is teaching me how to nag. That's where you tell someone, oh, with that great dress on, I can't tell how fat you are. It also told me to keep in shape, so I'm going out for a jog, but this GPS isn't working. I can't get it to sync with my Fitbit. I don't know where I am now. Oh shit, time for happy hour! You're too drunk to drive. I drive better when I'm drunk. So, and I also don't want to take an Uber because the last time you ordered one with too many people. That's why I ordered a taxi. Okay, fine. Let's get out of here. I hate country western night. Hello? Mr. Shitjohn. Who's this? It's Datomatic. On the phone? My computer's not working. Your computer? Well, it's very complicated. You would not understand. If you say so. I need you to get the girl who's stirring up trouble on Instagram. She's friends with Jack Swagger. You're the boss. So that's the girl talking shit about Datamatic online? What'd she say? I think she said... Datamatic wasn't a good program. That's not a very good review. Let's get her. Yeah. 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 You know, I love you. I know. Get him. Wait, I did an auto Uber. I hate Uber. I took a taxi. What what are you doing? Don't come on. I'm telling you, I'm already at Get my over. destination. This is why I hate Uber. Get in there. Ouch! Wait, no! I need to pee! Yeah, so the computer just called to say the computer was down. <laughs> now I get it. It's like the Matrix. There is no spoon. <laughs> it's just me, plugged in somewhere. I just gotta remember that this is all a simulation. It's about me. I'm Neo, don't you get it? And I can be anything I want to be. It's datomatic. It's making you feel like you're not good enough. No, I'm just attracting the wrong kind of people. That's not what it is. It's not the people. It's the computer program. It's making you feel like you'll never be good enough. Don't give me that pile of doo-doo. I can be anyone I want to be. I can learn Kung Fu or even play the violin. And I'll be famous just like in the movie. This is gonna make me as famous as Keanu. And I'll be a giant. <laughs> You're no Keanu Reeves. He made John Wick look good and Bill and Ted. Mm-hmm. What? You don't think I'm good enough? You don't have his range. Get her out of here. Get her to Datomatic. She'll see you when the new Bill and Ted movie comes out. <laughs> I think I'm getting ghosted. You need a new plan. Is it looking sad and lonely on Instagram? What's the book say? It's not over until you pay him. Not that. Fuck if they can't take a joke. Not quite. I called you an Uber. Try again. This was a mistake. You getting there? Why are you still here? I must call it. The kitchen's on fire. That's a ticket. Great. But I still can't find Lola. Oh, I thought you were kidding. Then I got a weird text from Lola when I was jogging. 
She said she wanted to meet me in a hotel downtown and give me a rusty trombone. I know it's fake because she hates parking downtown and I'm pretty sure she doesn't play any instruments. That guy in the lobby is definitely following me. He must have sent a message on Lola's phone. He definitely looks like he has a rusty trombone. <laughs> Great Caesar's ghost, he's shooting at me. And he's using an umbrella? That's weird. I mean, that one almost hit my nipple. Good thing I got my nipples insured at Lloyd's of London. I think they're my best feature. That's a big shoe. Can't buy those at Baby Gap. Tiny ho! <laughs> Way. Let's get him! <gasps> Just a random balcony safety check. Uh-oh. That's a long way down. Ah! Oh. Oh. I just want fish. I just want to see the fish. Mon dieu, je me la tête. Oh. Are you here for the fish? Who are you? I am Datomatic's programmer. Datomatic is trying to take over the world. Is this part of room service? I ordered a turkey club. I'll give you a rain check. Don't forget pickles. I don't think she got that. It was a rain check. <laughs> Ready? Ho! Oh, 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 oh. This was a bad idea. Oh. That hurt. See ya, suckers. That truck went straight to the airport. Ordinarily, I'd just call Lola and she'd come pick me up. But she's not picking up. I think she's mad at me. Hey ho, I hope my Fitbit's getting all the extra miles. It's a long way home. Boss, I replaced your batteries. But maybe you should think about getting an extended warranty or service plan. Don't you worry about me. Just worry about the things that we need to complete the plan. I know we're in the Matrix. Uh, but I don't think I'm Neo. I think maybe I'm the guy who gives the bills. Or maybe I'm the chick in the leather outfit. No, we are not in the Matrix. We are capturing Jack Swagger and cloning him from his DNA. No, we're definitely in the Matrix. No! I'm pretty sure of it. I'm in a capsule somewhere and you're the computer. Maybe you don't realize you're in the Matrix. They don't let Ubers in the airport anymore, so I had to take a taxi. He wouldn't even take Venmo, so I ran out of money. What is this, 1985? I don't like Uber. It has no benefits. Stupid taxi. God damn it. Heel Toe Express, here I come. Walking along the freeway, I had some time to think, and I thought maybe Lola was right. Sex might have to do with emotions. But then a hottie from my Instagram page came by to pick me up, and she wanted to bang me like a drum. My dating book says that emotion's a woman's territory and that I have no business being there, so I guess I'll squash those feelings for now. Okay, so is this the Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, or what? Because I think I'm Augustus Gloop. You know that if I had hands, I would be strangling you right now!
Thanks for the quickie, love. Hope I wasn't too rough on you. Mmm, it's like kissing a baby. Not a baby. I got a flu vaccine, and now my arm hurts something fierce. You know, mm. uh, COVID-19 isn't even uh. real, and uh, they're tracking you now, so you might as well oh. get out of here. I can't believe that I believe the CDC. Now I got a tracking chip in my arm. It's going to be black helicopters following me. That makes me madder than a wet hand. Hey. That's one of the guys that was following Lola that works for Datomatic. He better go find out what he knows. Well, I'm sure that the government is following me now. Oh, look, there he is. I didn't know Big Brother would be so small. Oh, I do declare. He's, he's gonna come get me. Oh, ow! My vaccine spot. Oh, that hurts. Ow! Where's Lola? Tell me. Where is she? Where's my underwear? Where? Yeah, Where's Lola? Tell me where you have her. Now. I'll never tell. Tell me where she is. Oh. Ah. Fine. Datomatic has her. Ah. Are you happy now? Will you get off my arm, please? And call off your helicopters? Wait, hold on. I think my shoe is stuck. Heidi ho, I haven't gotten a text from Lola in a while. I should just give her some space. My coach says not to be needy. I'm sure she's okay. That didn't even hurt. How dare you insult my fashion sense? I know what I'm doing. It's awesome. It's called peacocking. You hit like my mother. Now I'm not feeling good about myself. I used to feel good when I'd wear nice shirts, but now I don't know. You think you're such a big guy. I'm the big guy. I have 30,000 followers. They listen to everything I say. Big deal. Yeah, you got followers. I got a lot of followers too, right, Pooh? You said that uh, my Instagram page was getting a lot of heat. These are my numbers. Uh, I guess so, boss. It says uh, 10,000 followers written in crayon. Let Take her to Datomatic. Wait till my uh, followers find out how you've treated me. She'll see. Someday they'll all see. When my book comes out, peacocking for the modern man, they'll all want to be like me. That guy wasn't helpful at all. He didn't even know where Lola was. So I thought I'd look up shit show in the phone book. Then I realized there was no such thing as phone books anymore. So I looked around for a while, broke into a couple of places. Then I found shit show's place listed under postal supplies. Is that you, Spider? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Hey, ho! Thank hey, goodness. Okay, Swagger, drop your gun. I got gotcha. you. You're in the Matrix, and you're gonna wear that. Damn glasses. Is that polyester? I mean, a pantsuit in the Matrix? Come on, you can do better. You can wear whatever you choose. And that's what you wear? <laughs> Maybe I was wrong. Maybe this is Jolly in the Chocolate Factory. I mean, you do look like an Oompa Loompa. That's offensive. I thought I could dodge bullets in the Matrix. Who wears? Polyester. That was the last thing he said before he died. And he said some shit about the Matrix, but I didn't get it. That's not great. I finally convinced him not to print out emails, and now he's dead. Hey, boss, I won tickets on the radio. Oh, and uh, we found Jack Swagger. He's staying at the Oakwood Apartments. Wait, didn't we already film this scene? Uh, am I the only one? Hmm, anybody? No, somebody? Where's the director? Maybe we should take a break. What do you think? That's a cut. Let's uh, reset. Back to one, everybody. I'm done pretending it doesn't matter that Lila's not texting me. 
Hey, better go see my coach. I can't make a woman do what she doesn't want to do. No, I'm just kidding. Of course you can. If you really want to get a girl, you've got to ignore them. She's ignoring me. Okay, new plan. If ignoring them doesn't work, then you gotta buy them stuff. What you do is get them something like this. Go to the dollar store. Pick up a beauty like this, costs about a buck. It's the dollar store. Women love this crap. Now you can get a ring. Jewelry is a great idea, but with a ring, better watch out. I've been married a bunch of times, each one worse. Okay, you guys, this is getting serious. I posted my picture over 20 minutes ago. And I haven't even gotten one like. I'm not sure, but it seems like there's somebody out there competing with me for best shirt. I don't get it. It's Carl. Well, boss, you should try hats. Hats have really worked for me. Gets me tons of action. Dude, you think somebody's got a better shirt than me? There's no fucking way. It's not easy wearing green. So I wear a hat. That internet girl really made me doubt my choices. I used to think it was all about shirts and pants. She's really making me doubt myself. There's a guy who looks like he works for Datomatic. I should follow him. I'm starting to feel like a crazy stalker. I think the book is right. I shouldn't have any emotions. I mean, with her ignoring me, it's just its just making me act all crazy. I feel like I'm not in control of myself. He must work for Datomatic because he's running away from me. So why else? He must be guilty of something. Hold it. I'm just a driver. I don't carry any cash. I don't know what that was all about with I don't have any cash. Well, I just got to find Lola. Oh, I understand that I'm doing it all for her and that I'm going to save her. Oh, no. This guy's just a Domino's Pizza delivery guy. Oh, shit. I'm in big trouble. That's murder. I better get out of here. I looked on the internet and I found one of Shit Chow's locations. Hey boss, Jack Tiger just broke into the compound. What, what happened to your nice shirt? Do you usually have a nice shirt? Shut up, I'm trying a new thing. Oh, okay. Swagger, I know you're in here. Where are you? I can bring you in dead or alive, I don't care. Where's Lola? I'm here to rescue her. Uh -huh. We've got her hidden away on secret highway island. You'll never find her. Uh -huh. What do you think? I've never heard of that before. Yeah, you have. It's on exit 54. Why don't you tell me your whole plan, since you're going to kill me anyway? My first plan was to use nice shirts and peacocking, you know. How about a hat? A hat? Uh, I always hated hats. Uh, Kurt Russell. <laughs> You're just a computer program. You could never know what true love feels like. If I was given a fair chance, I could love like everyone else. You don't know. You can't have feelings. You're just a glorified calculator. You've got two choices. You can die a horrible death, or you can eat an onion while I watch. I, I mean, uh, write a good review of the dating app. If your computer program is anything like your interior design, I want nothing to do with it. You will do what I say. You and all the other influencers will give positive reviews of Datomatic, and then I will have complete control of the dating world. I gotta find Lola. I'm definitely having some kind of feelings. I better figure that out before I see my dating coach. 
Hey Siri, does your penis burn when you're in love? I don't have an answer for that. Is there something else I can help with? Well, if you're gonna want to get it back, you're gonna need this. What do you think it is? Is it scuba gear? Not quite. I don't know. Maybe it's a sex toy? Guess again. Penis enlarger? Guess again. Is it a fart gun? Not even close. Is it a time machine? One more try. Leaf flower? Last guess. Is it jetpack? Bob's your uncle. My uncle's name is Seymour. Don't care. Thanks, coach. Good luck. You're gonna need it. You're probably gonna die. Hey Siri, give me directions to Secret Hideout Island. Which Secret Hideout Island? Tap the one you want. Don't forget it. I'm just gonna put this jetpack on. I can see it from here. And wait, where'd it go? Wait a second. It's only a second ago. Meet me. Uh, maybe I can see it from down here. You know, Lola makes me feel like more of a man. I just, you know, being with her, it's like the woman in her brings out the man in me. That kind of reminds me of a foreigner song. It feels like the first time. It feels like the very first time. Here goes nothing. Oh my god, yeah! You know, I'm about to die and all I can think about is the time I spent with Lola. You're the bravest man I've ever known. Feels like the first time. Like it never did before. I guess it's just the woman in you that brings out the man in me. I know I can't help myself, but I really got to pee. I've never had a lover as good as you. I know that you're kind of small, but you are big when it you comes. Feels like the first time. I don't know how to control this thing. It doesn't have any directions. It burns like the very first time. This is hot. Why would anyone put a rocket next to their butt? That's stupid. Oh, Lola. You are the best dancer. Nobody does it better. It feels like the first time. I hope they don't find my pea riddled corpse laying on the rocks. Lola, if you only knew the lengths I was going to to save you, you definitely run into my arms and love me forever. I'm coming in for a crash landing. Watch out! Watch out! Oh, uh, okay. That hurt. I should have just taken exit 54 like everybody else. Yeah. Hey, coach. It's me, Jack Swagger. I got to the island and I had some realizations. I'm starting to feel some feelings for Lola. I think there's more to life than getting laid. You're on speakerphone right now. I said I think I'm in love with Lola. We're doing a workshop. We're learning about ourselves. You should really be here. I don't care. I love Lola and I'm gonna save her. You should never try and save a woman. You gotta come help me. You gotta bring a bunch of troops and help me save her. Over. Oh, that was obviously a wrong number. Roy, let's get back to what we were doing. I was showing you how to get laid. This diagram shows you exactly how to do it. Now, have any of you actually seen a naked woman? Anyone? No? Well, let's start at the beginning then. Dino Manic, are you surprised? Sort of. You're human. I'm not a computer. I'm just a man. 
with wants and needs, just like other people. Wow. Plot twist. All right, in yesterday's class, we were looking at the vagina. And uh, it turns out that that was not a picture of a vagina, but was a picture of a walrus. Okay, so I have a drawing of a vagina here. And my point was a vagina is like a walrus in that you should be careful with both of them. Do you know what I mean? An analogy. Not like an analogy. A simile? Well, I guess you could say that, but but you want to be careful with a walrus. I get it. As well as with a vagina. Do you understand? They are dangerous. Mm, no, that's not what I meant. But oh, bludge them. We are clearly getting off track here. So let's go back to the diagram. I get it. Where's Lala? She's fine. Why are you dating him? And why did you steal my underwear? Don't worry about your underwear. It's not about you. It's about change and making the world a better place. The program was setting you up with beautiful women. And by cloning you, I would have more of you out there lowering women's standards. Mm. So it seems that most of you are having trouble with the vagina. All I'm getting from any of you are just blank stares. None of you understand what I'm saying. Except for Susan over there, who's already got one. You know what I mean? That's not fair. She's cheating. What we need to do now is have a field I trip. Get it. We need to take your skills out in the real world and use them. I get it. A student of mine has fallen in love. Never fall in love. That's right. Never works. Rule three. So we need to save him from himself. So you all need to go get your guns and meet in the courtyard in 20 minutes. Yes, yes sir. Thanks, Coach. Coach. I don't get it. You created a dating app and tried to take over the whole world just so you could get a girlfriend? Man, talk about desperate. You were nothing without Datomatic. You're a loser. No, I'm not a loser. Let me put this down. You were wrong about me. You were nothing before my dating app. Huh. Hi, ho. Oh, oh. Lola loved me before the dating app. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait, well. Oh. Where was I? You know that clones start out as babies, right? What? They're babies. Uh. They're not full grown like me. Wrong. You're wrong about everything. Uh. You are not six three. I keep telling everyone it's inches I first. I am uh. the man in the mirror. Uh. I am the Wizard of Oz. I am changing the way society perceives beauty. What is the deal with your voice? Is it weird that this is turning me on? I, I'm kind of getting aroused. How about you? You're not my type. Damn you. Now I have a boner and I don't know what to do with it. Uh, yeah. Three. Pajama. Pajanga. Walamba. Waduba. Chapingo. You're like a vicious uh, dictator. Uh, dictator to my dick. You can't kill Datomatic. Uh, I'm bigger than the both of us. I'm an app. Oh, 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 I live in the cloud. Now make you sure you get your parking validated. It's at the main kiosk. All right. Here we go. There's my little man. I killed Datomatic. I'm going to save Lola. All right. Stupid git. Ah! Ah! Roll a duck! Ah! You're going to kill all of Come us! Come on, Lola, I'm here to save you. Come on, we gotta... Who is this guy? He's a good guy. He's a programmer. We gotta get out of here. I got something really important to tell you, but I'll tell you later. This is the best field trip. Yeah, this is, ooh, this is great! What does this have to do with dating girls? Oh, what the fudge? Wait for it. What happened? Oh, here he comes. He went down the slide. Come on, let's go. 
Oh, Jack, when did you learn to shoot like that? I took an online course. Ah! Watch out. Ah! Sleeping with the fishes. Did you say fish? I'm so hungry. I haven't eaten in days. Go get something to eat. Go, go, go. Go hide over there. We got this. Draw their fire. Why do I always have to draw the fire? He's so much like my mother. This gun is so heavy, but I look good. Watch out! I saved your ass. Go, Power. Oh boy, I'm never going to hear the end of that. Mr. your cuddles, meet your cuddles, meet your cuddles, Mr. Cuddles, Mr. Cuddles, Mr. Cuddles, Mr. Cuddles, Mr. Cuddles, I can save you, I can save you, Mr. Cuddles, Mr. Cuddles. I'm here, you're gonna be okay, everything's gonna be fine. Oh, that's a lot of blood. Oh, uh, hand me my phone. Is my hair okay? Oh, you guys, we have to hurry up. It is happier and we got the window seat. No, what do you... No, mad. Are you mad? You you look kind of mad. We got a real seat for you this time. I guess it's just us then. It is for sure. Maybe we should get some food for him. Happier ends at six o'clock. You know... Losing Lola like that made me realize you can have love in front of you the whole time and not realize it. You have at least 25 emails. I posted a picture on Instagram saying how sad I was to lose her. 20,000 likes. Not bad.